<laughs> and we are live. <laughs> hey everyone, it's OP here. Uh, I'm just going to get on a shared vibe on Facebook and we are all set up. People are joining us, which is cool. So, hey! <laughs> Hey everyone, it's OP here. Uh, it is Friday, I'm really excited for the weekend. And um, what better way to start the weekend than by opening a bunch of boxes, right? Uh, so uh, a bunch of boxes came in the mail. Uh, one of these I've had for a while now, and um, I'm really excited to open it, because uh, yeah, it's, it's some big, big stuff. <laughs> and um, I think one of these came in the mail today, so I thought I'd open them both at the same time. Uh, feel free to give me a shout in the comments, uh, or if you just want to say hi, or if you just want to post a load of gifts and memes, then you do you. That's all cool on me. <laughs> Alright, so without any further ado, let's get to mystery box number one. Which is this guy right here. So let's have a look. Yes! <laughs> awesome! I don't need that anymore. Cool. Uh, yeah, so I finally, finally got a mini rig, and um, I've been wanting one of these for time. It's one of those ones where you uh, you often don't realise you, you want one or need one until you actually get into it. And uh, of course, I went for the green model because obviously I would, you know, come on, it's me. <laughs> so let's have a look. We've got some cables. Got a nice little mini rig lanyard, which is pretty sweet. Uh, we've got a little sticker as well. <laughs> a couple of stickers. Sick. And what's the name? I'm guessing this is the beast. Awesome. Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, I can't wait to start causing some havoc with this. That is sick. Yes. Sick. Cool. All right, and it's the uh, new Bluetooth model as well. Uh, so uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to getting mobile with that. Uh, okay, so that was the little teaser. What we're going to go on to now is is the big deal. Now, I, as I say, I've had this for a while, so it's not in the actual big box. So we're just going to have to like pretend this box is the same one. Yeah, how about that? <laughs> That'll work, right? <laughs> Totally legit boxing, you guys. <laughs> it is this beast. Got a GH5. Now, any of you that know me know that I do a lot of my filming on a GH4. If you didn't, you do now. Um, so I've been using my GH4 for about the last two, three years, mainly. And um, when I was originally filming with that, uh, you could do 4K at 24 frames a second and you could do up to 96 frames a second at 1080. This beast right here uh, can do 180 frames a second at 1080, and it can do 60p at 4K, which is insane. Uh, this means that basically my quality is gonna go even like up in terms of like production, the, the kind of stuff that I can do. So anyway, I'm sure you don't wanna hear me flapping my gums about this, so uh, let's actually get into it. Oh man, this is going to be cool. <laughs> so if you just joined us, this is the uh, OP Freaking Out Over Tech uh, broadcast. Uh, so yeah, you're probably going to see me um, freak out just a little bit. Oh, this is cool. <laughs> this is it. I will try not to epically drop this after I've just got it out of the box, which I'm really afraid about doing. Uh, here we go. There she is. Yes. So um, the really nice thing about the GH5 is that all my existing glass, uh, my, my lenses and that, uh, and batteries should work with this. So yeah, that will make a really nice addition to all my gear. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yes, Pat, yeah, I'm finally opening it. I know it's been a long time, right? Yeah. I can't, can't wait to get into that. Let me just see if I can grab a battery, because the batteries should be universal. I might just get the rest of the stuff out of here. So we've got a strap. Not that we ever really need to use that. Um, so we've got some USB to, I think that's a proprietary cable. Power cable for the charger, I'm guessing. Charger, awesome. I uh, don't know what that is. 
Oh, I'm gonna have a look, have a look in the manual. I don't know, what is that? <laughs> I'll have to have a look at that. And um, see what's going on. Oh, here we go, here's a battery. Nice. I think that is about it for that. So, let's see if this has got any juice in it. Yep. Oh, that's nearly dead though. Let's see if we can find a, a better one. So this is one that should be pre-charged from a bag. Let's have a look. Oh, lovely. Okay, cool. Yeah, so that's all working. And uh, um, so any of you guys uh, who are interested in this sort of stuff, uh, I've got a Metaphones adapter, which goes onto my Canon glass, which saves me a lot of uh, like messing about with different lenses. So let's get this on here. Oh god, this is always a really nervous part. This is when, when you're putting this because it goes like right into the actual thing. There we go. Okay, awesome. Sweet. Right, so I'm gonna leave that there for now because you don't want to see me messing about with this for, for time. But um, before I go, because this is going to be a real short broadcast, I just want to say that um, uh, if you haven't booked your tickets already, Elusive Festival is next weekend. Uh, that's from the 8th to the 10th of September. Uh, you can get your tickets at elusive-festival.co.uk. Uh, there's always a really good festival down there. It has loads of really awesome stages. I think there was a video that I posted from a uh, takeover stage last year of the uh, giant sort of projection mapping transformer robot that was coming into uh, the crowd. And uh, yeah, like that was really super crazy. So you've got, uh, let's see, I've got the Lost Stage, which is mainly like bands, Imagination, which is, uh, you know, like Psy, High Trance, all that sort of stuff. Uh, Bliss is doing his first and only exclusive set. Is it not first? It's an exclusive <laughs> set uh, uh, in the UK, uh, so definitely get sound for that. Uh, it's Takeover, as I mentioned, Off The Rails, which is, well, after techno, Takeover is like drum and bass, all that sort of stuff. And uh, Urban Mischief is more about the dub and uh, the breaks, that sort of thing. And they've got a new stage this year called Clock Tower, uh, which is going to have loads of crazy artists on it, including like Congo Natty and uh, all that sort of lot. Uh, I've also got a ton of content coming up this month as well. I know things have been a little bit slow uh, on my YouTube channel, uh, but I do have a lot of stuff coming up. And now, as you can see behind me, my studio is fully set up. Everything's going to be a lot, running a lot more smoothly, so that'll be really cool. Uh, so we've got a bunch of videos coming from Boomtown Chapter 9. We've got a 360 video of Spin Scott, who's doing some really crazy jungle. Uh, we've got a graffiti video from Peaches. Uh, Kundalini Fire from Noisily, and what else have we got on here? Uh, yeah, and just to say uh, like a massive, massive shout out and love to all of you guys that support me on Patreon. Uh, I really, really do appreciate it. Uh, if you want to get early access to any of the stuff that I do on YouTube, uh, just sign up. It's uh, patreon.com forward slash surrealflix. Uh, I'll put the links in the description below. And I'm, uh, as everything is set up now, I'll be able to start doing vlogs more recently, well, more regularly, I should say. And uh, yeah, I will include any info on the latest events. I've got a review coming up with the 360 camera that I use. And uh, yeah, just lots of awesome stuff, really. So um, thank you guys all so much for watching, and I will catch you after the weekend. <laughs>